Well, hey there, guys. Today I got another padlock for you. This one's going to be the Avis 5550. Uh, I got this padlock from JD. So, JD, thanks for uh, sending this padlock out. I'll put a link to his channel down below in the description box. Uh, it's a pretty neat little lock. It's from uh, Avis from their 55 series. They got a bunch of different sizes. I think everything from 60 millimeters all the way down to 25 millimeters. And uh, this lock can be a little bit difficult. I'll show you guys the key bit in here. Got black zippo this time, so hopefully people will be able to see the key bitting. There's a look at it. It's been rounded off. The key's well used. You can see it a little bit better on this one here. So there's a look at the key bitting. It's got five pins in it. And the lock does work, but it can be rather difficult. So like I said, the key's been rounded off just a little bit. So it's kind of difficult to get the keys to work. Gotta really jiggle them to get them to work. I'm not gonna spend too much time with it. Um, to pick this lock, it makes this lock a little bit difficult. Down here at the keyway, it's a little bit opened up. So I found that if I take two tension wrenches, thin one from a uh, southward and take my standard tension tool put them in there together the bottom of the keyway that seems to make up for the space down there get that set there we go and i'm just going to be using my number one hook pick from uh peterson just going to go in here look try to get the lock into a false set there's number five pin start pulling my pick out there's another one. Feels like I'm about on the first pin there. There's a deeper false set. And there it is, picked open. Um, again, it's going to be the Avis 5550. It's a fun padlock. It took me a while to figure out how to tension it. But after that, I was able to get the lock picked open. But there it is. JD, like I said, thank you for sending this lock out. And I'll put a link to his channel down below and as always guys thank you for watching and you guys have a good one